back, we're shifting one of our wide receivers into another slot so we can try and catch the defense off guard. But Elias is stepping over onto the sousaphone for us, and there's a very specific reason for that. Now, this piece we're playing is called Second Line. Second Line is an older song in the jazz literature, and it is something that was so ingrained in my ear that I had an opportunity to do a recording for the Moet Music Festival, and I didn't even realize that I was playing this chart for that. I just knew that I was playing a second line piece, I was playing something that I thought I was just making up by ear, but then all of a sudden, nope. Second line, also known as the Joe Avery Blues. So, as we listen to this, um, we actually had a very interesting discovery in our jazz band class one day, and that is, that for myself personally, I have this little silver trumpet that I just recently got repaired, that we discovered after it was repaired by Ropers in Grand Junction, that it is 99 years old. The trumpet was manufactured and produced back in 1923, and it was so old that it was actually back before. If the trumpets, could you hold them up for me so they can see those little pinky rings? There's a little pinky ring, if one of you can point it out for me. Uh, the other one, up by the bows. That one right there. It's a little pinky ring that they just resin on top of, or for upper jazz players, sometimes they call it an octave deep, and they squeal like that. But this was before that was even a standard on the horn. Well, I thought this was pretty cool. So I started sharing with the jazz band, like, hey, look, I found this out about this trumpet. It's like really old, and yeah, that's sweet. Magnus walks into class the next day with a trumpet that has a second valve slide that's sticking straight out to the side. We discovered that his horn was 10 years older than mine. <laughs> and both of those horns are older than this piece, to give you kind of the root of how old jazz literature is in the context of American culture. It is the American contribution to the greater world music. So, without further ado, second line, also known as the Joe Avery Blues. Oh, and the tuba I pointed out, that was because they used to play on the tuba for the bass line. So, there he is, yay!
piece for the jazz band. What we've got for you is something a little